Welcome to this tutorial. Today I will show you how to use HDR footage captured by Magic Lantern using Sony Vegas. So the first thing to do is to create a new project and then you insert your clip onto your timeline. And as you know, Magic Lantern films HDR footage by changing the ISO every second frame it captures. So the first frame being darker, the second frame will be overexposed and so forth. So what you do with your clip is you copy it and you paste it into a second, another video track that you place right above or under the original track. In my case, the first frame is an underexposed frame. So what I want to do is to cut that first frame and then I go to the properties of that clip, I disable the resample, and I set the playback rate to 2. I do the same thing on the second track, but I do not delete the first frame. So on the second track now I only have an underexposed clip. Now because you have set your playback rate to 2, you will need to trim down your clip. And after you have done your rendering, you will be able to slow it down either using Twixter or only using Sony Vegas. You can stretch your clip back to a 50% playback rate to have it play at the normal rate. And now the way to blend those two tracks together is so you go ahead and add the chroma keyer effect to the first track. You click in the color box and you can choose the color picker to click on an overexposed area of the track and then you set the load threshold and the blur amount to a desired level. So you just play around with those values until you get something that you like. So as you see the blur amount plays a major role in that effect, you will want it anywhere between 0.1 and about 0.5 will be about the maximum you want this and you can play with the low threshold and the high threshold sometimes will give you better results as well. And that's it, there you go. You have a beautiful HDR image where you get the better exposition of both ISO values. So you just go ahead and render that clip and then you will use what you have as a result and slow it down because this will be rendered at 200% speed. So you just render it uh, slowing it down to 50%.